Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Brittany if you're new here, but if you're not new here, hey girl, welcome back. We are doing another day of Vlogmas. So if you're new here, I'm doing Vlogmas for the very first time. So if you guys like vlogs, organization, plus size fashion, things like that, definitely don't forget to subscribe. But for this day's Vlogmas video, we're gonna do a what's in my bag. So I don't know the exact name of the style of bag that I have, but here she is. If you're new here, I got this bag on my birthday, which was October 23rd from my mother. She surprised me and honestly, I was just as surprised as anybody else because this bag is stunning. This is what it looks like. So it has handles like this so that you can hold it obviously on your arm, but it also comes with a strap. So I definitely wear it crossbody most of the time, but you can do either or. It is, uh, the strap is detachable, so you can take it off and then just wear it as a handbag if you don't wanna deal with this long strap. One of my favorite parts about the bag is the big YSL logo in front. I feel like if you're gonna pay that much money for a designer bag, girl, people need to know where it's from. <laughs> I love that it has the large logo in the front. It actually un buttons right there and you pull it back and then that's how you get in to the purse essentially pull the zipper over here and let's get into what's in here this is very realistic i haven't cleaned it out or anything um so let's just see what's in here first thing is my wallet first thing that i have is just my wallet so it's just a ysl wallet that matches my purse really really cute i like the size it's definitely the perfect size to go in here fits perfectly so yeah first thing that i have is my wallet next item is some clorox wipes so gotta have these on hand at all times then i have my makeup bag so this i actually talked about in the last vlog that i posted but i got a set of three brushes from morphe and it came in this slim white little um, packaging so i just put all my go-to makeup in here i have a summer friday skin tint a patrick ta bronzer duo uh, Rare Beauty Blush, the same brushes that came in this set from Morphe, some eyebrow, Benefit Gimme Brow, I mean, sorry, and then some telescopic mascara, I believe is what that is. Uh, I also have a lip liner in here, and I think that's it. Just a quick daily makeup that I can do in case I'm running late for work or something. I want to have that in there so I can get that done. Then I just have some random lip products. So I have this Lip Butter Balm from Summer Fridays. Anything with a tint because it automatically wakes me up in the morning when I look dead. <laughs> I also have this Merit Beauty lipstick. I'm not usually a lipstick girly. I'm definitely more of a gloss, but I really like this one. This one's in the color Slip and it's the Signature Lip Lightweight Lipstick. So yeah, really like this one. It's really soft and creamy, doesn't feel drying at all. Then I have my keys and my key fob to get into my apartment complex. I have a hair clip, <laughs> random hair clip. I usually get these on Shein. They have so many different sets for like a dollar and you'll get a whole bunch of different colors. Then I have my AirPods that I use for work. Then I have a tampon because women then i have the fenty beauty heat in glow heat 03 i think is the color but these fenty heat lip glosses are so good i can't recommend them enough they are plumping so that's why they're called heat because you do feel some tingling sensation but they smell really good they smell really good they don't feel as painful as some plumping ones like the Too faced ones I can't do those. I feel like it's just so uncomfortable. Then I have some hand sanitizer. Again, because we're living in these unprecedented times, <laughs> as people love to remind us. Then I have my pill case to take all of my meds. And then I have the last big item that I have in here is my iPad. Let me take my notifications off. So I've been using my iPad for everything. I've been using the app Notion to plan out my day, plan out um, Christmas lists, just a bunch of different things, even my bills and everything. It's kind of like a one-stop place where I can make notes and put everything in there. So the iPad has been really helpful for that. I also made like a vision board as my screensaver. I just downloaded a bunch of photos from Etsy and then put them together and made that my screensaver. So it kind of keeps me in check, reminds me to keep my shit together, to actually get things done. So this is definitely really helpful. I'm more of a real pen and paper kind of girl, but I still feel like the 
mini iPad is the best. This is actually pads that just came out, the new iPad minis. I got this in the color Starlight in case you guys are interested. It's the perfect size for a notebook. So it's definitely not as big as the other iPad, but I feel like if you're just gonna use it for notes or you don't really have any like graphic design or you're using it for school, things like that, I don't really feel like you need the bigger one. Even if I was in school, I probably would still use this because it's a decent size. It's like a little notebook and I just write everything in here. So gotta have my little iPad in there. Then I have a hairbrush. This is a wet brush that I got at Ulta. Just a little pocket size. Always have to have a hairbrush, especially if you're like me and you wear extensions because throughout the day, you just need to brush your hair. Um, then I think this is I think this is the last thing you guys I have this NYX butter gloss in the shade butterscotch This is probably my favorite shade out of these And then the last thing that I have is a little card that I use to get into the building at work and Yeah, you guys that's it. That's all I have in my bag. So not much granted. I just got this bag in October so it's only been about a month and a half so I haven't really had time to shove a bunch of stuff in there but as you can see this little bag is pretty mighty because it holds a lot for it to be able to hold a makeup bag an iPad a wallet a full-size wallet mind you um, Clorox wipes it's just very roomy and I highly recommend if you guys are looking for a new YSL bag um, I think my mom got this bag at the outlets also, so it could be um, at a pretty good discount. I haven't checked, but I will find it online and I'll put it in the description box. But that's it for me. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what I'm missing from my bag. If you have anything in your purse that you feel like is a ride or die you need in your bag, comment it down below and I will check it out. But thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on my other Vlogmas videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. It was all a big mistake Never meant to miss the date I was caught up with my friends I forgot that we had plans So the roses on the floor And found the champagne by the door